those of you who have been following the mounting the solar panels on a wall will notice a marked difference here um, and I've changed my mind about this hopper guttering and rainwater pipe so I brought it underneath the panels but this video is not about this it's about that join there I needed to extend this pipe and I didn't have the right socket so I made my own so this is about joining lengths of PVC pipe okay so we got two bits of PVC rainwater pipe and the first thing to do is to put a chamfer on the one that's going inside so we just need to work on that edge and this is a very coarse file just a matter of taking that edge off I suppose you could use a uh, A little grinder with a sanding pad would do the same sort of thing. So we take that out now. And just for the purposes of easiness, I'm just going to put that in there. Normally these would be long lengths and you'd do this on the ground. Right, what we need to do, two things. One, we need to warm that up, but gently. And the other thing is to just put a bit of furniture polish on there. These are mainly beeswax, but there's quite a lot of uh, silicone in there. So that'll help things along. So the thing here is you don't want to heat one area up more than the rest and it doesn't want to be too hot. If you heat one side more than the next, than the other, uh, when you push the other piece of pipe in it will all go off to one side because one side will be softer than the other. So we're just turning it and warming it up. It's getting there. twist it round and then just gently and there we go and just check that it's straight and when that cools off there's no way you'll get that apart rock solid so that's upwards so the water flow will always be that way even though that is so tight that I doubt if it would leak anyway there you go it's easy and then you don't go have to go rushing off and buying more pipe you've got a few short ends you can always put them together and it looks quite neat